Hello my dear friends today is Guru Purnima and uh, this is Dr Suresh and I am here to share some of the important things which my guide Dr Vasundra Shivanna principal got Davan Gere uh, that the things which she taught me during my post graduation as a teacher and those are really very important lessons and I am here to sh- share those important things with you the first and foremost thing my guide taught me is uh, that we should give more time and effort to treat the difficult cases uh, it is a general tendency of uh, any student that if you have a difficult case we tend to you know give up very soon and i had a dif- and, and similarly i had a very difficult case calcified case which uh, at that time was very difficult for me and i went to ma'am one or two times she i felt maybe she will uh, allow me to finish the case but surprisingly she kept on saying that no no it is possible you put more effort by looking at the x-ray i think she might have felt that that case is possible so uh, the general tendency is as a student when you go multiple times we know the teacher sometimes may give up and may allow you to finish the case very fast but she she kept on sending me back and because she was sending me back i had to put more and more effort and ultimately i succeeded in opening uh, that calcified canal and that case came out very good so that made me realize that sometimes you have to give time to difficult cases and by giving more time you will be able to do difficult cases in a very good way so that's that's a very important message which helped even today whenever i have a difficult case the second important lesson what i learned from her that as a teacher we should always be open for learning and uh, that i realized from her when she used to guide me for seminars i always used to read and prepare well for the seminar and whenever i used to go to ma'am she used to tell me that okay these are the things which are missing you have to add but if by chance if she says something new which she is not away she used to always ask me and uh, you know and she used to tell me directly that you tell me you teach me that i want to learn it i want to know more about it that is and ma'am was very senior i mean one of the senior most uh, teacher in the uh, dentistry in india and she telling me that i want to learn more about uh, what you have mentioned here is really amazing third important lesson which i learned from her which i did not like during that time is that she always told me that post graduation is not sufficient at that moment as a student i used to always feel why my teacher is telling me my post graduation is not sufficient because i struggled so much got sixth rank to state uh, on a merit went there and my teacher is telling me that post graduation is not sufficient sometimes i used to feel bad that why my teacher is telling me this but she always told me that you should have a higher aim do something new do do some new degrees uh, try for foreign countries try for newer opportunities and when i came out i realized that that words were very important because i ended up giving the us nbd adap middle east exam i became a co-author started my youtube channel uh, make some mark in endodontics with uh, my experience so what the the important quality of uh, madam to make me realize about the negative things or the reality or the challenges which i would face after my post graduation was was very important and many times uh, it is the duty of the teacher to make the students realize the challenges what they are going to face so that they can uh, mentally and uh, be confident to face these challenges as soon as you come out of uh, you know your post graduation or or any career path what you choose the last important thing as a teacher she always had was whenever she was in a college or the, the dental school she was very strict as a teacher she used to praise us when we used to do good work she used to criticize the next day when our work was not not up to the mark as a student we always like a teacher who always praises us but this quality of ma'am that one day she is praising and second day she suddenly is angry that we have not done case properly 
was something amazing and on the same day when he has shouted us in the morning if we go and meet her to show, show some seminar or some work in the evening in her home she used to always treat us in a very uh, kind nature even though she has shouted us in the morning so she was very different in the school and uh, whenever she was outside she was she always treated us in a very friendly way so she always had that fine margin where she was like a friend but in the meantime she was also like a very strict teacher for all of us so these are the very important qualities which i read from her if you know if you if you want to share some things which a teacher taught you during your under graduation or post graduation please do mention in the comment section and i would be very happy to uh, read those important lessons which you learned from your teacher bye for now.